table. So I'm sorry I've been away for quite some time now, but I had a really uh, bad cough for several weeks. And then when that was finally over and I was able to speak uh, for the videos, my mic died. So yeah, I've kind of not been able to do any of the videos that I wanted to do. And I've been crazy busy as well. So I'm sorry. Hopefully I'll be able to produce a lot more videos now. But that is why I've been away for a while. And now it's summer and I'm actually on my summer holiday. But of course I had to do videos for you guys. So here I am. So today I'll be talking about some of the long reach battery powered hedge trimmers from Steel. So as you might know, I don't do that much hedge trimming, which suit me quite good because it is my least favorite part of the job. But we do some and um, all the work we do on hedges is with battery powered tools. And I must say, I am so, so very impressed with the battery powered hedge trimmers that Steel has come out with. We've got, I think we've got five different ones now and they are all great machines. In this video, I'll be talking about the HLA66. That's this guy right here. And the HLA86. And that's the run here. Now it's probably outside of the camera. Oh, oh. Alright. <clears throat> so these are the new ones that just came out this year, in Denmark at least. And um, I really, as I said, I'm so impressed with the power and what the battery powered uh, hedge trimmers can do. So let's start with the HLA 66, um, which is a long reach battery powered hedge trimmer. Much taller than me. So this is a 205 centimeter long um, battery powered hedge trimmer from the AP system product range and it works like all the other um, long reach trimmers it comes with a 50 centimeters 20 inch long double-sided double-edged blade and um, I'm really surprised about how much it can actually cut when it's battery powered and I do prefer using the AP100 battery for it because then it's much lighter and I don't like the AP100 battery for the chainsaws, but for the hedge trimmers, the batteries work great. I've literally been using these hedge trimmers for several days in a row, not changing the battery. So the battery life is incredible in these machines. It's not like the chainsaws where they actually just, well, they just suck out the battery power <laughs> so quickly. These guys are really long lasting. So that's awesome. So this guy has an adjustable working head um, from minus 45 degrees to 70. So that's pretty awesome when you're trying to reach the top of the hedges or just when you're walking and you need that bit of curve. Then it's really nice that you can adjust it in several steps and not just two. And also when you're folding it up, it's only 132 centimeters long. Look at that. Pretty neat. When working with the hedge trimmers, I use an excessive amount of <laughs> uh, super clean just to keep it running. And just because I really feel the difference when I'm spraying this on and when it's dried up. So, I spray them pretty much all the time, but that might be because I'm not using hedge trimmers that much. So yeah. Alright, so what I really really like about this guy is that it is really lightweight and easy to use, but still changed up the handle. So I do like that they changed up the handle a bit, that because on the old ones you had to hold inside but now you can hold on the outside here, and I like that. What I don't like is this new feature right here, because let me just show you down here. 
This is just really big and annoying for me to reach when I'm working. And also, I can turn on the hedge trimmer just by doing this and that. So I don't even need to, to press this in. So it seems like there are three buttons, but I only need to use two. The one that's difficult to reach and this one. And for me, I just prefer the old version of the two buttons here and the on off system up there. But apart from that, I think it's a great machine and I definitely recommend it. But I do wish that they would go back to the old on off system and then or it's actually more of a lock system and then yeah I think that works better yep then let's move over to this one and see if I can take it without everything falling to the ground so this guy is the HLA 86 and it's a telescopic uh, long reach hedge trimmer and I think it's even too tall for me to open it up right now but I'll try yes I can do some of it there we go so this guy can go from 260 to 330 centimeters and that's really pretty long reach but that also means that it's a very heavy machine um, at least compared to the 66 that I was just showing you so I think this will work great if you're standing on the ground and you have to reach really far or if the hatches are extremely wide and you and you can't really reach it in any other way then this guy will work but it is heavy to work with for long days and um, I prefer using letters and moving around more than using heavy equipment. But it's pretty neat that you can adjust everything um, without any tools. So let me just see if I can do something so I can show you. Uh, like this, you open it up and then you can use the telescopic uh, system. So that's nice because um, you don't want to use any tools when you're standing in awkward positions already. It's much easier with chainsaws. They don't take up that much space. So there we go. So folded up, this guy is 180 centimeters. And that will tell you a bit about my height too. Some of you are asking. Um, the cutter bar on this guy can be adjusted 115 degrees. So it's like the other one. Um, it's got lots of different steps. Ooh. And um, that's really neat when you're working with it that you can adjust it uh, for the side to the top or bottom whatever you need to reach but um, let me see if I can show you it really does take up a lot of space so up here you've got all the different steps that's where it will uh, stop when you're adjusting the angle of the cutter head and that's pretty awesome too so yes and as I said, they're both part of the AP system product range. And um, you can use the 100, 200, and 300 AP batteries for it. I do prefer using the 100 battery for hedge trimmers because that's the lightest battery. And I think it gives the products a nice balance. And also, I don't like carrying too much weight around. And um, they seem to have the same amount of power no matter what battery I put in and since the battery life is great on these products I think the 100 battery works great but today I brought the 200 just because that doesn't make any sense when I'm saying that I'm using the 100 but that's just to show you the battery so yeah as I said I luckily I don't do too much hedge trimming I do at home and I do um, for a couple of weeks during the summer but I mainly use chainsaws and that's perfect for me. But some of you asked if I could tell you about the products that I'm using and I hope that gave you some idea of the products. Otherwise, feel free to leave a comment and ask me a question. 
all leave a comment about videos you'd like me to do and I'll see what I can do to accommodate those wishes. Otherwise, I just want to wish you all a happy summer and stay safe. Oh, and by the way, as I told you, my mic broke down, so it's not free doing all of these videos for you guys. So if you want to and you feel like it, you can support my channel by buying merch. Uh, it should be on my YouTube channel. If you go into my channel, then you should be seeing triple shirts and uh, Chainsaw Holic shirts and stuff like that. Uh, not a freak, of course. Um, so yeah, go in and buy some of that stuff because then you will be supporting me as well. And remember, you can follow me on Instagram at Female Lumberjack or find me on Facebook at Felicia Bank. See you soon. Cheers. Showing you stuff. Oh, oh. 100 battery product system rate. Jesus Christ. Ooh. I flew a telescope. Today I'll be talking about some of the long reach. <laughs> long reach? Wow, words are really coming out right today. Sushi!